Hey guys, I've got a lot of questions recently about uh, lithium batteries and I figured I'd go and show you the lithium battery that I have in the RAM. So I made, this is the first one I made. I just used a plastic crate and there's uh, flame retardant foam in here just to keep everything nice and snug. Don't move around there at all. And then I have uh, these are for uh, bolt down six spot terminals. Um, these ones are Toolmaker, but I have Ill Customs and other brands too. So basically, I just use that connected to the bars. There's just aluminum plates in here. I did these myself. The plates in all cost me five dollars. So that's I bought a drill bit, I bought uh, jigsaw blades, cut these and drilled these myself. The cells, um, these are Headway 38120 HPs. Um, they're eight amp hour cells, so there's three banks of them for a total of 24 amp hour in here. And so far they work fantastic. In this setup, I run it along with AGM. There's an ecstatic bat cap right there, and then there's a 55 amp hour AGM under the hood, and. I got this Bluetooth battery monitor. You can get this on eBay for like 25, 26 bucks. It's freaking awesome. Links with your phone, has a display on your phone, tells you your voltage, gives you graphs, uh, charge voltage, crank voltage, all kinds of neat little things. 25 bucks, I highly recommend getting one of these for any battery system. It's just a nice tool to have. So, yep. Uh, these cells, how much did I pay for them? Um, roughly 150 bucks. So the terminals were thirty dollars. Plates were five dollars. Cells were 150. So in all, I have about 185 dollars in a 24 amp hour lithium battery. And if you compare that to what's out there, it's a pretty damn good price. So, thanks for watching and uh, hope you enjoy the video.